and thank you for joining me for a midweek shave. I really appreciate it. How was your week going so far? I hope I find you well and there were some great shaves. Right, a bit later than usual, it's my day off work today and me and Mrs. B have been quite busy this morning, so this is why it's late. Right, what are we using? As you can tell from the, uh, the thumbnail, we're using a barrister and man's Levithan. And there's the uh, the mythological sea serpent there. He resides in the depths and the darks of the ocean, waiting for the world to come to an end before he can make an appearance and do what I don't know. <laughs> well, that's, that's what it's supposed to represent anyway. Anyway, fantastic scent. It's a nice dark scent, but it's a nice warm scent, comforting scent, in my opinion. Has a leather cord in this, and with that you've got coffee, sandalwood, cedar, and musk. I'm not getting any cedar from it. I, the first thing that comes to me is the coffee. Mild, but nice. Ten strength, I would say, is about four and a half to me. Yeah, I get a bit of the musk. I I, I don't get anything apart from the coffee that really stands out. But you can tell it's got the accord of the leather and the, the sandalwood. It's nice. There's the pot. I'm not going to show you the ingredients. It's probably too dark for you to see. Right, new brush in the den. And we're going Italian. This is my newly acquired Riva. Riva brush. And this is the Green Heather Briar with a 26 millimeter Mancurian knot. I've been breaking it in all week. I've had this about a week now and I've been breaking it in and it's kind of getting there. I'm just gonna add a little bit more water to this. Put it back in the soak. It's been soaking for about 10 minutes. Oh, let's keep it moist. Razor, razor I haven't used for about six, seven months. And I absolutely love this razor. It's the Carve Overlander. I absolutely love the design of this razor the handle is superb and i'm dying to get my hands on the stainless steel version this is all brass conversion three piece it's got a blade gap of 0.73 millimeters and it's got blade exposure of is it 0.7 yeah 0.7 so it's got a bit of positive blade exposure there but not a great deal, not a great deal that you feel anyway. Blade, Blade was kindly gifted to me, the top of these were kindly gifted to me, gifted to me by my good friend Kevin, Kevin Shaves. Sent me these vintage pulse silvers, or pulse silver, made by Wizamet. And these are from Poland. Made in Poland, it's got the Wizamet logo there, as it has on the blade wrapping. Double wrapped. Now, did Wizamet make pole silvers? Because you've got the Wizamet blades and your pole silver blades now. And this is its second juice. So it's got the pole silver and Wizamet there. And it's got the pole silver and stainless on the other side. Yeah, this razor's getting a bit of patina on it now. So it may be time for a polish. I like the look of the patina on razors, brass razors. I just don't want to own one with patina on. I'd rather have it polished. But yeah, it's getting a bit of um, bit of patina on it now. As you can see, the blade exposure, it's there, but it's not a great deal. No overhang to worry about. All right. I'm going to get this brush, brush, brush as dry as possible and gather up our puck and then I'll add water as we go along. I just want to get a really good load into the knot. So I hope you've been having some great shaves as always. I had a very busy morning like I said. We've uh, up at the crack, normally the shaves go up between eight and half eight because I'm getting up and I'm ready for work but I overslept slightly this morning because it was my day off and we had to take the car in. But it's MOT at eight o'clock 
and we've already had a report back that it's failed which I'm disappointed on but we've been lucky it, it's sailed through the last four years suspension brushes front and back and it's going to cost me close to 500 quid to get it fixed so that is being fixed as we speak hopefully if they got the parts this morning if not be late on this afternoon so we're just waiting for a phone call now to go and pick the car up and pay the bill and then once we took that off i took mrs b for a breakfast date i took her for breakfast <laughs> with the spoons jim <sighs> took her to with the spoons for a full english it was nice it's lovely Right, let's get lathered in. What a beautiful, beautiful soft knot this is. I think I've done a really good job of breaking this in this week. The usual method of soaking it. Hot water. times in the fridge and then out again dried soaked in the fridge and then on the last process if you like soak in the freezer Took it out and then I got the wife's hair dryer on it. Because the idea is of breaking a brush is not just to soften it up, it's just to split the hairs, the tips. And I must admit, I've done a great job of this. And it's beautiful. Yes, it's, it, it's, it's a beautiful scent, this. All year round scent, I'd say. Not sure if it was uh, a limited edition one, but uh, here we go. Carve Overlander with the Paul Silver Vintage. I think these blades came out in the 70s. Yes, it's going, it's going to shed hair to start with. Lovely blade, please. Nice glide and cushion with the soap. It's in the omnibus space. It's a great base to work with. Nice and smooth. As I say, it's got a positive exposure. You can feel the blade, but it's quite smooth. So how's your shaves going? Let me know in the comments what you're using as always. Thank you so much for the comments in the, in the last video. Work's been busy. I've had a last couple of days off. What day was it? Monday. Monday was on a really quick delivery. Um, and it 
kind of took its toll on the injured knee a bit. I was in quite a bit of pain again on the Tuesday, so I decided to have the day off to rest it. As you can tell, the knot is holding on to the uh, soap, as badges do. Not a problem, we'll just go back to the puck. It's thin, but you still get great cushion with the omnibus and great slipness. I don't mind. A thin leather. Good for you wear uh, straight razor shavers. Nice thin and wet. Confident feeling in the hand. You can really hear the blade cutting whiskers. Well, the weather's not too bad today. Warmer than yesterday, we had quite a bit of a frost, and we had a dusting of snow yesterday. That's all gone now. It was minus four yesterday. Started off at minus two this morning, but it's about four degrees now. So yeah, and it's beautiful, the sun, blue skies. I know where uh, other parts of the country, mainly Scotland obviously has had um, quite thick snow, a lot of disruption, people are stuck in the cars. Skills are closed. It's not supposed to be hitting us here in North Wales properly until tomorrow, Friday. We reckon in some parts it's going to be minus 15 degrees. Well, if it gets too bad here, I won't be going to work because we get snowed in here. Yeah, I'll leave a link into Reaver Brushes. They have some superb, some beautiful handles. I think they do briarwood and um, pewter. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. They're a little bit pricey, but you know, they're handmade. I think they're uh, getting made to order as well. Design your own. But yeah, absolutely beautiful. Beautiful. I wanted a, I wanted a Reva um, brush for quite a while now. They were out of my price range. I fell lucky with this. I put it off eBay. Brand new at a fraction of the price. So I got lucky. Yeah, the, the scent strength I... I Goes to a positive five, I think, once this is lathered up, in my opinion. Been looking forward to using this soap. I wanted it for a while. I wanted it when it first came out, but funds were a bit strapped at the time. Here we go, against the growth. I thought I had it, another hair in the blade there, in the razor. Yeah. 
I just love that sound against the growth. Yeah, there's nothing worse than just waiting in for a phone call, is there? Not if they can do it today. So comfortable. So comfortable. Nice and slick. So tell me with your brass razors if you've got any guys. Do you prefer just to let them age gracefully and patina? Do you like the patina? Do you prefer polished? Like me? Let me know in the comments. I'm always interested in other people's opinion. The smell of brass can put people off as well. I happen to enjoy it. I just love the smell of brass. The usual pickups around the jowls and the jawline. to talk about really guys right I think I've filled you in everything's been going on wow beautiful Cold water rinse, brush perform well, beautiful soft knob. Do you have a lever brush? Can I ask you that? I don't know. <laughs> Feel a BBS with the towel, can't you? When you rub it on your face. Another fantastic shave. Right. No, no, I'm black. <laughs> I haven't made a mistake. Fires unscented. Splash it about. Like I said, I'm going to start using some of my witch angles. Good toner for the skin.
Beautiful. Beautiful. God, I feel so refreshed. Right then, matching splash. We also have a bit of skin food in it. Oh, you really get, um, with the splash, it's almost like a coffee liqueur. Got that leather. Smell more of the leather and the splash than you do with the soap, in my opinion. Obviously, your mileage may vary. That was beautiful. Wow. Right, matching balm. Leather's About half a pump, I think it's more than enough. Oh, it, it, it's all beautiful. It's all beautiful. I enjoyed that. Like I say, don't forget your SOTDs guys. Do the t-shirts in the in the wash. <laughs> That's the man leather fan. Leather fan. Yeah, made up the brush. Absolutely made up. Should see what's left in the knot. You can see, still quite a bit of water in there as well, that's why it was so, still a bit thin. But still, absolutely, I, I was happy with it, I was happy with the lather and the performance of the brush. Absolutely love the style of the brush. Absolutely stunning. Anyway, that's it from me. Thank you so much again for joining me, I really appreciate it. And uh, sorry, it's a bit late. I've <laughs> just been busy. Um, that's it. Have some fantastic shaves. Enjoy the rest of your week. And uh, stay smooth and stay safe. I'll see you Sunday for the uh, weekend shave. Bye for now, guys.